Hey, how's it going, friends? My name is Angel Alex, and welcome back to the channel. We are back with some more of The Witcher 3. Look what I did to Roach. Oh my goodness. I, I, I have a lot of money left over from, you know, grinding out money for the house upgrades. And, you know, why not spend it on our boy or on a girl, Roach? <laughs> so she's all pimped out right now. But, um, we are finally here, you guys. The last handful of Come missions on. or quests um, left in the Blood and Wine DLC. I believe we only have, like, two more quests left. Um, so I think there's probably, probably only gonna be, like, one or two more videos left. And it's just crazy, you know, how far we've come, um, how long we've been playing this game, and it's finally coming to an end. And I said this last time, it really is bittersweet, because, you know, it is a sad time. We're finishing this game that we've been playing for, like, six months straight, but at the same time, it's like, you know, Look at the journey we've been on, look how many videos we've made, all the things we've experienced together, and it's just been an amazing, beautiful experience, and I'm very happy that I got to play this game for the first time with you guys along with me. But anyways, enough chit-chat, let's go ahead and wrap things up. Geralt, good you're here. Ready to attack Duntine? I'm ready. See you already prepared a plan. Walk me through it. We have two objectives. To find her illustrious highness's sister and capture the man who blackmailed the vampire. Duntine is a modest complex. Several old buildings, a high wall around them. At the center of the enclosure stands an imposing keep, restored not long past by the elderly knight of the castle, Roderick. We mean to strike here, through the main gate, then secure the area in front of the keep by storm. How many men defend Untine, you know? Roderick maintains a team of knights for defense. They are no army, but they could number several dozen. Also, Roderick recently took in a band of foreign mercenaries. About them we know very little. Sintrian's men, gotta be. Ran into a few in town. They tried to kill me. Need to hit them from both sides. You draw the defenders, keep them busy. I'll sneak in the back way, find the women, make sure they come to no harm. I'll vault over the wall as soon as you start your assault. Your plan puts you at great risk. But I sense you will handle it well. Let us go. So it begins. <laughs> Quick, we grab Roderick's horses and we bolt. We won't vault far if the boys out front don't hold. Ooh, Not so fast. Boy. Little Super change of plans. Kill him! Wow, Ow. you're gonna make me wait. What?
Alright, there's a lot of them. <laughs> Let's uh, whip out the oils and bombs now. read somewhere that if you freeze them bloop, and if you put away your sword and punch the shit out of them nope they lied okay <laughs> Yes, sir. Roderick sent them to get the horses. He's looking to flee. Can't let him. Oh, 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 let's go. We're not looting? All right, let's go. I see no ducals along the road. They must not be guarding it. Faster! Roderick, Roderick was right. right. So can't flee. flee. On the wagon. We'll manage. <laughs> hey, guys. Someone's here. They've breached the back wall. Come on. Bloop. Kill him. Ow. Surround and kill! Ow. I hate archers with a Go passion. On, Beat the bum butcher! I shall show you, rogue! Ow. Yikes! Bitch! 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 Let's go, boys! Let's dance! I didn't mean to do that, but that works. Little bitch. Uh, I gotta axe you guys with shields, I forgot. Ah, uh, you swing so. That works. Oh my gosh. You, sir. Come here. Alright, come on. Woo! Woo! My goodness. I, I did no wrong. Nah, -uh. kept the wrong damn company. Centrian's men, where are they? Uh, uh, I knew. Shouldn't have let them under my roof. Where's the hostage, the woman? Uh, what? What do you mean? I know nothing about a hostage. Must, must be the handiwork of my... Guests. Where are they? Where are they now? In in the keep. Ready in their escape. There's someone with them? Woman named Sienna? Of, of course. She she convinced me to let them in. And a whole pile of trouble along with them. Where is she? Pack packing. We were to leave together, an old fool. I'd have Done anything for her. Where is she? In the keep too? It, yes. Her chamber is in the tower. The top floor. Of course. What? What will become of me? I'll help him. Hmm. Here, press it against the wound. It should staunch the bleeding. I Thank you. Alright. Man, I can't save our meditate right now. Fuck. Alright, let's go. What is happening? I'm at this one. Kill the shit like that. Not let them die. <laughs> you will die, you little strunza! 
All right, let's dance, big boy. You and me. Ow. Ow. Fuck, bro. All right, back to Quinn. Never mind. You will die, you little strunza! I will dare you to shreds! Uh, <laughs> Can I meditate now? No. Too dangerous. Fuck. Hi, guys. It's, Oh, fuck. Oof. I would like to save and meditate, please. Giving you one last chance. Yield. And Harlot got us into this. Kill him! Attack! Oh! Need to get into the keep. They shall pay for everything. Let's go. Oh man, more of them. Here we go. Here we go, boys. Woo! Oh hell yeah, yeah. You guys got this. Y'all don't need me, right? Jesus. Fuck. <laughs> this is insane. Ow. It's always the archers, man. Fuck him up, fuck him up. There you go, there you go. <laughs> what is this, bro? <laughs> All right, I think y'all got him. Let's get in, let's get in. Wasn't expecting to see you two here. We thought you could use our help. So, Witcher, this is no time to explain. Where is Renna? Expect to answer a lot of questions inside. Let us go then. Oh my God. Can I be a vampire? Are you... Are you hurt? If any of them... You know me. I'd never let them hurt me. I just waited for you to come. I... Nah, nah. I didn't know where to look. They threatened to kill you. I... Forgive me. I failed you. 
everything okay? Why was she looking at the bottle like that? Now we need only find Anna Henrietta's sister. Where should we look? Do you know? Mm-hmm. Ran into Roderick, Duntine's lord. Told me where I'd find Sienna. Then speak and let's grab her. Time is short. Said she was in a room in the tower. Very one we're in right now. Which, incidentally, looks nothing like a prison cell. And just so happens there's a carafe full of wine here. Bet it's stolen Saint Real. What's your point? You lied. Stop playing dumb. I know everything. Your plan, that this was part of it. Witcher, what is this? Sorry, Deadlaff. You've been had. My friend, please. You must listen to what Geralt has to say. Never was any abduction. She faked it to be able to control you, manipulate you. You lie! He seeks to turn us against each other. Let... let him speak. Blackmailers, pure fiction. She planned everything. You killed all those men at her behest. That... is impossible. Sorry, Dedloff. She used you. Part of her plan. Right, aren't we? <laughs> I had a feeling too, man. Oh! You will come to Teshamudna and explain all. If you do not, I will raise Beauclair to the ground. This I promise you. You three days. I shall be waiting. Oh. He just fly off. He did not wish to act rashly. He's gone to soothe his nerves. Think he'll do it? Make good on his threat? I cannot say. He can be unpredictable when fury consumes him. I shall go to him. Come again? After what he just You don't know Detlaf like I do. If I don't do as he says, he truly will destroy the city. He's more than capable of it. Uh... <laughs> Conscience gets to you now? Better... Uh, better late than never, right? Well, it truly does seem the best option. Your Grace, we must proceed with caution. Guardsmen saw vampires here. They could still be about. Vampires or no vampires, my sister is here. Find her. Your Grace, that... So his wife, that last wife, Sianna, or girlfriend, it's I don't know true. her name. It's you. Sister is here. her sister. What have you gotten yourself into? So concerned, I'm surprised. Is there an ounce of truth to it? Did they you, say that already, or has it just been a while that I forgot? You feel resentment. I understand. But I promise, promise we shall work through all the unfortunate matters of the past. We will discuss them later. Captain, escort Siana to the palace. I shall meet with her as soon as we return. As you wish, Your Grace. And you, a lot. <laughs> you have my thanks. I cannot believe my sister was so near the whole time. Roderick of Duntine shall answer for treason and blackmail. Uh, I had no acknowledge of the blackmail. <laughs> uh, he had no acknowledge. Roderick got duped and used, I just like the vampire. Apropos, were you able to establish who kidnapped his beloved? Nobody. We've discovered 
Siana blackmailed the vampire, ordered him to kill those men. What? What nonsense is this? She is his missing lover, staged her own abduction to force him to do her bidding. He was a tool. Whole scheme was Siana's. She was behind it. You're mistaken. You must be. This cannot be true. I mean, it's Your all Grace, there. I know this vampire and... What? You know him? Who is he? Detloff. The same who so recently sat at my table and told me of Nazaire. Is there anything else you've neglected to mention? A dragon living beneath Mount Gorgon, perhaps? Is anyone else here a vampire? <laughs> Where is he now? Waiting for Siana. If she doesn't show up to meet him by an appointed time, he'll destroy Beauclair. He dares threaten us? Your Grace, we have three days to bring him Siana and... Not a word. You have three days to bring me his head. Oh, no. No more secrets. No more helping vampires. I want what I'm paying for. The head of the beast. But he's not a beast. He was blackmailed. Do you think her grace's nerves have been calmed? Velvet rarely forgets, rarely retracts what she says, especially when forgets. Yes, well, even I must admit, Dead Love's actions were highly inappropriate. Reprehensible, even. Are you upset? Why would I be? Hmm, let's see. You're returning from your hunt empty-handed. No trophy. No new lead to boast of, then pursue. I don't get upset. Mutations, remember? Uh, could have happened to anyone. I don't want to say that. That sounds too, like... I don't give a fuck, you know? Like, yeah, I don't know. What can I say? It happens at times. Especially likely to when the monster I'm chasing can turn into fog. How do your employers customarily react when you fail to meet their expectations? <sighs> it depends. Peasants cuss me out. Merchants demand I refund their deposit. Whereas nobles mostly just release their hounds. And rulers? Usually threaten me with the gallows. A most illustrious grace awaits the gentleman. Your grace, the population demands she be punished. Siona's committed terrible crimes. Spilt so much blood. They... Another word, Palmerin, and I shall spill even more blood. Yours. Oh. I repeat for the last time, Siana is responsible for the death of many, true, but she is also my sister. We are bound by blood and by a shared childhood. I shall not allow her to be lynched. Your Grace, I fear the masses might rise. Storm the prison, pitchforks and torches in hand. Let them storm. They will not find her there. Siana is hidden away in a safe place. She shall await trial there until we have rid ourselves of this accursed vampire. Which, to judge by your means, has not yet come to pass. Did what we could, but... My patience is at an end, Geralt. Where is he? Where is Detlaf? Uh, well, well, we're working on it. We're working to find that out, Your Grace. Do you take me for a fool? I... Wouldn't dare. I care not one whit what you have worked on, are working on, or shall work on. I'm All right, interested she needs to in out. results, which thus far have been nil. Ah. At times, I hunt foxes. Do you know how it works? The ducal huntsman releases the hounds, they catch the fox's scent, chase the animal down, and lead the batu to it. All within an hour. You, Witcher, have had a week. The aid of my most excellent knights. Yet, you have tracked absolutely nothing down. I've begun to suspect my beagles might have done a better job. Uh, find him sooner or later. <laughs> Summon your beagles. Uh... 
I don't know. Allow me to point out certain subtle but essential differences between a higher vampire and a fox, or game in general. Truly. Like the ones between a pathetic quip and a treasonous offense. Watch your words, Witcher. But to the matter at hand. Have you managed to establish anything? Your Grace, it seems Siana tricked Detlaf, used him to murder the knights who escorted her into exile. We have reason to believe that... What the...? Your Grace! Vampires! What? Speak now! Vampires! Oh, they protect the city! Oh, no. Get them the Latour defense to square near the boat landing. But so many lives lost. Damn it. Oh, the music. What the hell? Oh, man. If it's war this Deklaf wants, it's war he shall have. Get out of it, work. This time I'll hear no excuses. Palmer and you... Oh, my God. Oh, no. Get her out of here. Let's go, bitch. Alright, wait, 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 wait. Siana failed to appear as summoned, and there, Detlef was not making idle threats. Seems not. Need to make some serious plans of our own now. It's gone too far, damn it. Regis, you mentioned there was a way to draw Detlef out, a way you've avoided resorting to so far because you thought it was too dangerous. Is that how I put it? Do forgive me, and I've misled you terribly. The word dangerous is simply a scandalous understatement in this case. Regis. Another inner monologue growing out of a personal dilemma. <laughs> Just tell me how to flush Detloff out. Force him to meet. Please. In due course. But first, Geralt, I'd like you to consider the alternative. After Here all, we go. you could fulfill Detloff's demand and liberate his beloved Siona. Think Detloff still believes Siona's innocent? I believe he suspects something. He must. And he seeks to understand what happened. And for that, he's declared war on the entire duchy? What can I say? Moderation was never his strong suit. Really want to free Siana? Hand her over to Dedloff? Refuse to accept you consider that wise. It's hard to believe, I know. But Dedloff is not actually evil, merely impulsive. He needs but meet with her, speak with her, and he will spare the city. Mm. So say I agree to this, because I might. Still no chance Anna Henrietta will. I do not recall ever suggesting we ask her permission. <laughs> Things could go wrong, though. 
Um, can't be harmed. Can you guarantee her safety? Any idea where Cyan is, Cyan is being held? The meeting. What if it's nothing like you say? What if it goes sour, ends in a fight? Willing to guarantee Siana won't get hurt? It seems unlikely in the extreme that... Didn't ask for a lecture on probability. Need a simple answer. Yes or no. I vow that not a hair on her head shall come to any harm. Alright. If he says so. Got serious reservations about this plan. Not least among them, we have no idea where Siana's being held. You heard the Duchess. She's not at the prison. Hardly a reservation. More of an excuse. I'm certain you'll find her. You must merely decide you wish to. Hmm. Could ask Damien. Duchess treats him like a lapdog. Keeps him close most times. He might know something more. There, you see? I knew you'd think of something. Bravo. I trust I've dispelled your doubts, then. Not so fast. We're not done talking. How would I go about luring Detloff out of hiding if I wanted to? With the blood of a virgin? You see, somewhere nearby lives an unusual denizen. One of the unseen, ancient and powerful vampires. Among the oldest and strongest. Mm-hmm, and? Tucson is this unseen elder's territory. All vampires owe him fealty while they are here. He need but say the word, designate a time and place, and Detlaf will be forced to appear. So this unseen elder, how do we convince him to summon Detlaf? We must find him first. The elder does not see arrivals unless he absolutely must. But locals, Oriana, for instance, you know, she too is a... Yeah, figured it out. All right, let's say she gets me in to see the unseen elder. What then? I don't know. You'll have to improvise, I suppose. All right, what next? Hmm, so I'm basically stuck. Either gotta give in to a blackmailer or fight him. You know what I would opt for? Should we free Siana and arrange for her to meet with Detlaf? There's a good chance we'll all survive this ordeal. Detlaf included. Regis, don't mean to put you on the spot, but I gotta know. Say I do decide to fight Detlaf. Who you stand with? Should you decide your sword is the sole solution, I shall not stand in your way. Appreciate it. Certainly hope so. Now, please tell me, what is it you intend to do? Oh man, I want to believe Regis knows what he's talking about, and that this could all end fine. Nobody could get hurt if we just free. Sienna and give her to Dutlaff. I would like to believe that. I really do. I... I just worry <laughs> that something's gonna go wrong. Either Sienna's gonna die, Dutlaff's gonna die. It's just not gonna go as smooth as we think it will. But I think I'm willing to try. It sounds to me like the better option. And the less messy option. It's just a little risky. So I think I'm gonna free Sienna. And let's talk to Damien. Crazy as the plan seems, I'll do it. I'll ask Damien about Sienna. You won't make me beg. I knew you wouldn't. Slow down. Not promising a thing. Just want to get a feel for the situation to start with. Coming with? Of course. Many hands make light work. <laughs> Damien could be in danger. Or dead. Do you think so? He seemed battle-hardened. More than a few scraps under his belt. Against humans, not monsters. Alright guys, I think we're gonna have to finish the rest of this in another video. I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. And subscribe down below if you haven't yet. Check out all the links down in the description if you're interested in the gear use. And I'll see you guys in the next video.